I feel like I fell asleep halfway through that game and then I woke up and I was like, oh wait, we're, we're still in it. We're Zelhua, we're, we're not dead. What? is up everybody i'm no lex given and this video i just want to provide some context on before you guys watch the game trying to get into the top 100 on the last day of the season was definitely an ambitious goal and for some context this game is going to come at the end of about 10 hours of streaming more or less i took about an hour and a half break to eat some dinner and just kind of refresh my mind a little bit but my hamster woke up so you guys can see my hamster in this intro but basically i was a little bit tired at the start of this game so the editing is going to be a little bit strange i'm going to speed up some parts and I'll do a little bit of editing on it as well, um, but towards the second half of the game, I definitely wake up a lot more, and uh, the commentary will definitely pick up in that regard. But I just wanted to give you guys that warning because this video is going to look a little bit different than some of the other games I put out. And I still thought it was a fun game to showcase. Because of that, there's only going to be one video today, and then I'm going to do one video tomorrow. And then I think on Tuesday, I'm going to skip a day. And Tuesday will be the day that I put out the game where I got to the top 100. So enjoy the video. And um, a little bit of a longer intro here. But that's because I'm playing with my hamster too. So uh, doing it all in, uh, in one take here. But um, yeah, hopefully you guys still enjoy the video, and that's it. Eeny meeny Loki, pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. Sure. Okay. Pair of Lonely Prince, not bad. sell both of these things to pick up the frog prince though i like the black cat too let's just lock next turn we take frog prince plus black cat that seems like a reasonable power spike Okay, we get a True Love's Kiss, but that doesn't help us too much. Um, might actually sell this Bad Billy to pick up additional pairs. Yeah, seems like I should. That was like our one of our better units, but uh, I think the pairs are worth it. Could be wrong, but Crafty gets so much better if we can grab a treasure. Seems worth going for. I don't think it makes us that much weaker. A 2-2 in the back compared to a 3-6. Like, sure, it's a little bit weaker, but... Baby Dragon hit the one thing that would be annoying. Oh, though, it didn't actually wind up mattering. And we just barely lose this one, taking four. Well, I would have loved to cast this Wish Upon a Star, but... Nothing we can do about that now. I gotta keep rolling. Nice. Let's make that, um... It's probably Dancing Sword. Context. 
Oh, they slayed with the black cat, so they created another black cat. All right. Feels like everything that's going wrong could go wrong this game, and we have rolled infinite true love's kisses. Yeah, for sure. For sure. It was, uh, wasn't jarring or anything. True love's kisses on Zell just seem like such a waste of time, though. Blech. Polywoggle also seems like a waste of time, but what else are we doing? It's a 5-1. We could maybe try to slay with it next turn instead, but like... I think it could be okay to just slay with it now. Yeah, just get the unit. We're gonna take a little bit of damage yet again, though maybe we can, uh, if we attack that Shadow Assassin, things could have been okay for us. Um, yeah, we take six. We get the Hippocampus. It's an idea. Okay, I do like some of this. But I like this and this. And Sugar and Spice here, grab a treasure, pump up Crafty. Probably just need to take secret stash at this point. Um, but we have a nice little start of the hippocampus board. Baby. Playing up against the lobby leader, though, everybody's lost at least one combat. We've just lost, like, five. I think I am going to switch back to sitting down. Opponent with the double Sporko. But things went pretty well for us this combat. Really. We still wind up just barely losing, but we only really take two damage there because... We cash in our secret stash. Don't think we want to play dwarves at this point. I am into the hippocamp plan though. Despite hating hippocampus in general. Gain some HP. Let's buy some golden chickens. More HP. Eat him, eat. Now let's try to find. Uh, maybe I should have taken the Tweedle. Just like buy animals for stats. It's not the craziest thing though. I'd rather find... Oh no. Um, yeah, okay, Princess Peep is quite good. And potentially allows us to do cool things with Nutcracker and Lancelot. These hippocampuses are, are scaling somewhat well. Um, if we can attack the court wizard, then yeah, we actually win this one. Though this is against the worst place person in the lobby, so I guess it shouldn't be too much of a boon for us. Let's take these peeps. Unless we buy a hippocampus first and triple the hippo. 
These shoulder fairies will scale with Zelhua. And Wish Upon a Star is also good eventually. Do I want Wish Upon a Star here? I don't think I want Wish Upon a Star, but I think I do want Shoulder Fairies. Cursed King taking some extra damage against us. Is it worth it? We shall see. So we're going to get in a decent amount of summons this game, though. So is my opponent. They've got the Reduplicator. Our hippos are not going to be enough against this person. I think we need to roll for five and four cost treasures right now. Um, yeah, we're going to take nine. So I think we need to find Monkey's Paw. Baby Bear also kind of cool. I think I need to find shoulder fairies into monkey's paw. That's how we turn this one around. We have like two more rolls to find it. We can sell these frogs. I don't love what's happened here. It's also Baby Bear, but then we totally lose the attack on the Shoulder Fairies. Got to do something with our gold. But I think we have not... We have not made this work well for us. Oh, I just cut the evil unit. Maybe I'm too tired. Maybe I'm too tired to hit top 100 at this point. Definitely feels like the plays are getting slightly worse over time. Hippocampus is getting a bunch of stats this game. Okay, this actually worked out. Okay, I don't know. Did the lightning bolt do it? Or did we just have a bunch of stats on the growing hippocampuses? Who knows? Kind of like the baby bears, too. Could also the end, and then I'm looking for six drops right now. So now I'm looking for like Doom Breath. Good boys. Oh, there's a Doom Breath too. I think I'm taking these good boys, though. I was definitely planning on taking Doom Breath, but I think this is a good boy game now, all of a sudden. Okay, I'll take Peep, Cycle of Chicken. I don't know what three drop I want exactly, but just Hoping that a pair of good boys can get us something done. <laughs> um, we'll see. Yeah, I mean, the peeps are doing nice work, too. Good boys are going to make these hippos pretty large. We just have to clear out this uh, court wizard at some point. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Somehow this player is also level 6. But I don't know what tier three treasure I want other than like, oh, okay. Haunted Helm also seems cool, but 
Uh, I think this is better. Okay, I think I like Lance a lot as well. Could go for Lady of the Lake on these good boys too. Um, I guess Lance seems pretty enticing because it gives us a tier 7 treasure right now. Alright, we gotta go for that then. I don't even think that's like asking too much or like too silly either. I think it's just probably right. So one good boy dies, that's not quite enough to activate Lance, but... Oh, frontline a hippo. Okay, cool, cool idea. You mean like that, right? Oh, or to backline Lance. To backline Lance. Smart idea. I like that. Good, good note. Good note. All right, that activates Lance. Our hippos are big enough that we're hoping that those carry us still. The Court Wizard, every single player is running Court Wizard in this lobby. Kind of nutty. Hopefully we can kill this Court Wizard soon. They take out our first hippo. Okay, Court Wizard's dead. Here comes... Okay, we take out their other ranged unit. That's also good. And now Lance can clear Juliet. Nice. We get a tier 7 treasure as well. If we get Mirror Mirror, um, I feel like we just won. Okay. Awesome. I'm not going to mess with that. Let's take Mirror Mirror. Uh, Bear Stain is now insane. Think we can afford Herc here. Maybe should be buying health. We're at 16, though. I'll buy health. We're Zelhua. We got a Mimic Chest off of this, but I don't think it's worth uh, 3 gold. I want to roll for Bear Stain. Spells are good, though. Alright, didn't find Bear Stain. Do I want to play Sporko? I don't think so. I think this is just insane. Mirror Mirror was the ideal treasure for what we had going on. We're still going to want to find a Bear Stain eventually. This Cursed King loves taking damage against us. All right, that's a good time for Lance to die because now the good boys can die and pump the Lance. Nope, Lance is going to die too. <laughs> Uh, they definitely got rid of our good boys in a really annoying way with those trees. But now the good boys can trigger onto these things. Yeah, these trees are annoying. Oh, my hippos are going to attack into trees now. That's annoying. Please attack the doubly. Nice. Okay, that's good. We save one of the trees. The sheep gets to potentially attack into this tree. After it clears that, I suppose. This sheep attacks into the tree. That's good. And now that trades with that, and we take out the sure shot. Awesome. Awesome. Those trees were scary trees. Yeah, let's grab health. Let's, let's definitely prioritize health and not throw... A game that is looking so clean. Coin of Sharon, really good. Ring of Rage, reasonable. Deck of many things, pretty solid at this point of the game. Yeah, I'll take a deck. Bear Stain. Looking for Bear Stain. Could take another questing unit. Echo Wood's interesting. So is Friendly Spirit. Let's just do Friendly Spirit for now. A 
Ooh, they're all dragons. We get a shrivel on a grim soul. And um, yeah, this is dragon trophy hunter. Interesting. Interesting stuff here. So they're, they're just making a big Jormungand and um, casting monster books and stuff, but not really trying to do anything crazy with that. All right, they do get a scam spell onto Hercules and a scam spell onto our Hippocamp. So, yeah, pretty annoying stuff. We are going to take some damage here, but that is why we gain some health. Do we take lethal? Don't tell me we do. 9, 15, no, we take 17. Wow, okay. Well, we take a little bit less damage now. But we almost took Exaxes if we hadn't cast that um, spell. Transformed into Pup. We get to take a good boy ourselves. Spear of Achilles. Pretty good on good boy. I think that's better than Pandora's Box. We already have Mirror Mirror. Let's just take Spear of Achilles, drop Dancing Sword. And now I really, really would love a Bear Stain. Awesome. What could we get? Muerte? Mordred. Okay. I'll maybe do something with that later. Oh, wait. Let's do this with it now. Um, yeah, this is really cool. So first the mirror mirror stuff happens. The good boy will resummon a good boy. It comes back huge with the uh, the bear stain. But then when this lance dies, I guess this will come a lance. But now when good boy attacks, okay, it didn't die. When good boy dies, we make a huge hippocampus. All right. Hercules will eventually get its treasure. Wait, did we get another treasure off of lance here? I think we did because it doesn't have a ribbon on it. So I think we're getting a tier six and a tier five treasure this turn. So this is happening. Um, tier five treasure, we basically just want mimic chest. Though I'll consider grabbing, oh, what's happening? I'll consider grabbing hand of Midas. Let's take Hand of Midas. No, but we're grabbing a tier 6 treasure too. So maybe we just skip this one. Yeah, let's just skip this one because we're grabbing a tier 6. Let's grab Wand of Weirding. I think the plus 12, plus 12 on everything is quite good with Good Boy. Oh, they're going to be attacking our back line, which is really awkward. Means we have to front line Bear Stain. Okay. Wow, that's annoying. Okay, totally ran out of time there. We're going to let my opponent slay against my back line, unfortunately. We do get to make a large hippocampus here. And that protects us from a slay. And now Good Boy gets in. And now we've got Good Boy Bear Stain with a bunch of other funky stuff going on. And um, rather large Good Boys. And my opponent isn't really Trophy Hunter either. So they're throwing away a lot of value. But their Jormungans are still quite large. But now they don't get to attack with their Jormungans for a second. Not sure that's going to matter, though. Yeah. Lightning Dragon does... No, that's not a slay. Well, okay. This is a close one. This is a close one. Oh, wow! Well, Goodwood comes back! Goodwood comes back! How big is it? Not big enough. 
Not big enough. Dang, we took exactly... No, we didn't take exactly. We took seven. We took nine. We were at seven. That's fine. Plus 33. That was a pretty sweet game, nonetheless. So I'm happy with that one.